This is so disgusting. <laughs> How did I die? My name is Sir Captain Beangle. I'm part of a species known as the Organ Spike. As you can guess, they weren't very nice to people. But my story isn't just about that though. My race has a supernatural gene that allows me, Beangle, to transfer my consciousness between generations. Basically, I'm immortal. So get comfy. This is the story of the rise and the fall of me. Our story starts in the great ocean of blood, where me and my fellow species head to land. This is my new home. A barren wasteland. Are you kidding me? What is this? A, a cronky? Really? Really right now? You're saying that to me right now? I'm, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna... What is that? Oh my god! My first encounter with another species went about as well as you could expect. <laughs> and now, it was time to evolve my species. <gasps> Is it my true love? <laughs> oh yeah, forgot about that. I can uh, change the course of evolution in my species, so uh, yeah. This is so disgusting. Okay, can you spit? Nah, I'm gonna grow up. Oh no, it's him! Oh no, it's him! Oh, I hated this guy. Everything seemed to be going well, but then... <gasps> oh my god. I don't know what that is. Oh my god. There's more of them. They're spreading. I need those extra monies. How did I die? Where even was it? What was that? I need to take my anger out. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! The alveoli are surrounded by capillaries. I learned that my brain grows in size every time I kill something, which is good for me. Because of this growth in brain size, I had a good idea. How about I get a partner? Follower. I meant follower. You only have to do this once. I'll follow you for the rest of the game. <laughs> Hate you. Come on, team of one. Let's move out. The dweeby ball. Huh. I should have suspected it was them. Okay. Go, 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 go. You can't kill on an empty stomach. It's important to stay fit and healthy on an empty stomach. I mean, don't stay. I mean, don't. Don't do that. Oh my god. Maybe teamwork does make the dream work. I like this idea. Alright, we kill one and more species and then uh, we go back, okay? What should I name you? Walk away, man. That's what I should name you because you're, you're too scared. And then it rained. Bad omen. Ha, <laughs> like I know what that is. Let's go home. Alright, I I don't I don't really know what the bones are that this bones are for. But this is disgusting. No, I'm not I'm not doing this. We're finally gonna leave that stupid guy. Yay, woohoo, yay! See you later, stupid! You too, you stupids! When are you gonna hatch? Oh, oh no, oh no. Hey, where's the all gone? No! So my people, my army, abandoned me 
and turn away man. So what you're saying is they all just left because of me. Yep. Hmm. So there was only one thing that we could do. We looked for them. You gotta stay here and you... Ah, be quiet. You have no idea what we're capable of. What are you? The trials and tribulations ahead were testing. Testing my patience, because it was easy. No, that's just a child. No, 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 no. Oh. Health three. That could be useful if we're in a pickle. You! You're the people who killed me earlier! No, that's it. Just... The crew Stupid name. My brain grew in size again, so I decided to give Turnaway Man a real name. Dave. He would be my one and only partner for the rest of the journey. The companion. We are not welcome here. The harbinger of the eggs. And then, just minutes after I named him... No! Turn away, man! Stop! Stop it! Stop! Oh! Oh! Turn away, man! I mean, Dave! Sorry, Dave! You survived me! Well, I'm not complaining. Oh. I have a feeling that's a bad thing. Well, are you okay? I said you're okay. Come on. Anyway, I headed back to my family. Are you ready, Dave? D Dave? There you are, Dave. You ready? Alright. Oh, come on! Thanks to my incredible leadership skills, just my mere presence upgraded their entire nest. And after more evolution, another member joined our group. Wait a second. I look fabulous. Alright, I'm super smart now, and I've realised they're going to try and ditch me again. So you know what I'm going to do in retaliation? I'm going to prepare. And kill these people as well, they're really annoying. Wait a minute. They didn't abandon me. That's because we love you. Give us a hug. Ah, 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 I knew you really wouldn't abandon us. Wow. And then another member joined our group. With our combined forces, the area around us saw a massacre. No species, not even the one that tried to kill Dave, could stop us. We even tried befriending another species. Team versus team. Oh, that's easy. We can sing. Ha! Ha! We're gonna beat you easy if you keep on doing this. Look at this. Oh, we can't actually do that. We can sing though. Yeah. Oh, but it's fine though. We can just, you know. Well, team, you know what to do. Lesson learned. Don't do that. Are we bad people? Oh! Oh! Okay, that's definitely not good. Uh, hello? Hello, I'd like to- I'd like to go back to the egg now. Hey, 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 hey! Come here. Better come here. Quick! Oh! I got out of that one. Ha! That alien gave us all the knowledge to survive. Now we can finally live without him! Goodbye! Goodbye! See you later! Now I can finally crush these stupid eggs. Oh no! Are you kidding me? I could not believe it. I was abandoned! Again! No matter though. 
They expected me to be truly dead if my egg never hatched. But as you can hear, I am not dead. Well, there they are. Uh oh, look who's back. Wait a second. My brain is And after this whole ordeal, I reached the peak of my intelligence. I had my biggest idea yet. Make civilization. But this would be hard. So I trained and shaped my species into the perfect form. I can say with confidence, this is the most powerful species. Get out of the way! Our new plan was to conquer anything we saw. And the perfect opportunity arised when a group of giraffes or something in invaded. So, like the civilized people we were, we went to go have a talk with them. Yeah! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> yeah! 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 I'm clapping. Can you hear that? I'm clapping. And hey, we got this weird totem thing, and our tribe got bigger. So you know. Okay. Uh, only, only I'm killing it. The others just don't really care, do they? Where's it? all the other... Are you serious? What? Yes, I know, it's disgusting. Let's just get it over with quickly. Now, let's go. My original plan was to befriend them, but something else caught my eye. Oh, we need a gift. Oh my god! Uh, wait, no. Right, new plan, so... Ah! Well, I guess there was no time to refriend them now because we're being raided. Men, we're being attacked. They're coming to attack us. I knew it. Those green people, them. We must defend it with all our lives. Here they come. Oh, a raid party of three people. I'm so scared. Now we know what we're dealing with. As retaliation, we decided to launch a counter-attack. Look at them and their stupid leader. They're weak. Let's just get them. Attack arm. Yeah. And, you know, to protect from the Cyan village. A single egg. Never mind. A single person named Ogleb. <laughs> Wow. Where are my people? Oh, there they are. Oh, wow. Oh no, Dave, get out of there! Can you go faster, please? We have no food. Everyone's dying. Just kill it faster, please. Thank you. It was an overwhelming success. Their intelligence was too low, and they didn't realise that. We had bigger ones! This victory gave my men more confidence and we grew in numbers because we had babies, because we laid eggs, because I laid eggs, because I'm a girl apparently. I don't know why. Everyone could go attack Cyan, but Dave, you stay here and you guard us from wild animals. That couldn't have gone worse for them! Craig just spam stone axes! With the looming threat of that big monster upon us, we decided to retreat. But he was distracted by something, I guess. So he finally got in there and finished them off. Until it came back! Okay, kill it quick, quick, quick. Oh no. What is that? Okay, shark monster. It's a pretty nice name. Where'd you get it? Your mother? <laughs> uh. Yeah, woo, yeah, did it, woo. Now we gotta upgrade. That's the animal stealing our food. Now 
now we get an actual house. And best of all, better fire. Now we seriously gotta go, 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 go. Oh, we live to see another day. Is that what they sound like? Bird sounds? So, I had to do the one thing that I had to do. Now we can have loads of babies. And with that, we were the most powerful ever. With the might of our army, we easily crushed the Lavender Village. And we're about to end this whole ordeal by destroying the Pink Village. And that's when realization struck. Dinner time. We're gonna be facing a tough enemy. You know what that enemy is? It's the shark monster. Ba ba ba. Just add a add a dramatic sound effect. Yeah, good. For a final challenge, I wanted to challenge the most powerful thing on my entire world. The shark monster. For too long the shark monster has reigned upon this land, terrorizing and screaming at everyone. So today, I say we bring it down. What do you say? Are you with me? Yeah. But first, a victory celebration. This just beautiful. <laughs> Let's go kill a shark! We appear from the sunrise and lightning strikes down. A line doesn't make any sense. Get him! Our opponent can kill easily. We must be very careful. Fire bomb! Fire bomb! Uh oh, Dave, be careful. Ah, I'm kidding, that's not Dave. This is Dave right here. Ah, ah. <gasps> Dave! our civilization had ever seen. But like the phoenix, we shall rise from the ashes and then uh, blow up a planet. 